Hey guys, right 92 here, and welcome to episode 4 of my FIFA 15 career mode. Back with Fulham again. And now, as you can see on your screen, we have got our first League 2 match of the season. So let's hope we can get off to a fantastic start. And let's see if we can win our first game of the season. Now. I need to change some of the kits around so I can actually see my players. Otherwise, I'm going to be in trouble and I'm not going to be able to see anything, which is a pain in the backside. So, let's get into this match and let's hope we can get a win under our belts. Penalties. Yeah, let's do the penalties challenge. Oh, right in the middle. Oh, that was bad. That was very bad. Let's hope I don't do that in a match. So here we are. Ivy Lane. First match. Fulham versus Cheltenham Town. Yoink. Run, Taggart. Run, Taggart. Shoot, McCormack. Goal. One minute, 54 seconds into the match. Ross McCormack puts us 1-0 up. That's what we're talking about. Beautiful real play there by Taggart. One touch, shot, goal, 1 0. Let's go. Now, d did I say you could do that? No, I did not. Go away. No, 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 no. no. Good shot, Mumbai. Drop it back. Ah, oh, it was rubbish. That was crap. That was annoying. I shouldn't have done that. I'm not even going to change my attacking setup for this match. No target, stay on side. McCormack. Oh, almost 2 0 then. So close to being 2 0. Good save there by Carson. That's a new glitch. In. Burn. Scores. Oh no, it wasn't even Burn, it was Taggart. Both the blonde dead players were up there anyway. But it falls to Adam Taggart. That's 2 0. That's Taggart's first goal in the league. And he really is becoming quite a prolific striker for us. It's going to be even better when we get side, hopefully get side of Berahino at the end of this match. Run, Captain Parker. Maybe not. That's fine. Up you get. Give me the ball. Roberts, Fights Parker, Stathalidis, Fights Kaniklic, try to find McCormack but he's probably one of the smallest players on my team with the exception of I think Patrick Roberts who's the only person that's actually smaller than McCormack. Just a touch, enough to take it over the line. Give me the ball. Okay, maybe not. Run, Hutchinson. Run, Hutchinson. I give. Give the ball to your teammate. That was a stupid ball. Really? Move to the ball, players. Come on. Ref is all over the back of his shirt. 
That was crap. A goal from uh, Exeter. It's a goal for the visitors. 27 minutes played. 1-1. One, one. Thank you very much, Alan. That's very well read. And that's a very good interception. One. Richards. We're going to catch him in the break. There we go. They're in. Beautiful save by the keeper. Thank goodness for our goalkeeper. Super Marcus Bettinelli. Currently over playing for the England under 21s in the European Championships. Don't think he's had a game yet though. Which is a pain. It's even more annoying for me is I haven't got BT Sport, so I can't actually watch it. Which is the UK broadcaster for the under 21 championships. Fortunately for me, a channel I don't have on my TV. Can't watch it, which is quite annoying. Oh well, it can't be helped. Beautiful turn by the Cormac. That should have been 3 0. That should have been game over. But it decides they're going to hit it straight at the keeper, which is never good. No, I need more movement than that. That's better. There we go. Into a Cormac. No. No, we're nearing. Give me. Give me the ball. Give it. Give it. Cheltenham, you do not deserve to be anywhere near my goal. You've got to be kidding me. How the hell did that happen? That was annoying. Well, 2-1. Off we go. Now only having a one goal lead. Okay, throw in there though, which isn't too bad. Ball, give, now. Wide. I said wide! So now you play it wide, but you play it to one of their defenders. Oh God, my defenders are rubbish. The players are rubbish. Actually, they're not. They're just Fulham. That's what they normally like. Give a free kick now, I'm going to punch you down and destroy your family. Good referee. Oh, a dig, Scotty. Ooh. Okay, Scotty Parker. Decent bit of play there by the skipper. Can we get a repeat of our second goal? No. Ooh, we can't. That's a pain. It's got to be half time now. Thank you. And there is the half time whistle. 2 1. Not the best half in the world. I uh, probably would have liked to have gone in at 2 0, not 2 1. But there we go. Can't be helped. So, let's see. Do I want to make any changes? Don't think I do. Actually, I will. I'm going to bring on young Gibson at centre back. And I'm going to bring on Woodrow for McCormack. I'm going to see if that does anything. And then we'll make the team more possessive and a bit more attack minded. Let's see if this now helps us run away with this game. Good strong challenge. Well, apparently Karaklitch is faster than every other player on my team. So how that happens, but okay. Heads. No, I said our head, not theirs. Alan 
And that's given away possession. Burns. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. I said give me the ball. Thank you. Through the middle. Woodrow. Surely. Oh, you absolute mongrel. Slide back on. Get your player where you need to have your player. The opposition back off, they could be in trouble when the ball gets to here. Not running away from the strikers. It's not what you're supposed to do, you're a defender. No, 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 no! So close to getting level. God, he missed that. Oh, that was a catastrophic mistake. <sighs> Did not realise the striker was running in there. Run, Hindman. Run, Emerson Hindman. Use your young American legs. Square. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Ah, okay, actually, it apparently came with a defender, so I'm not going to complain that much. Get up for the header. No, fine. Shoot! Oh, you... Okay. That was alright, Mr. Gibson. It wasn't too bad. Let's try again. Get up! Corner. Again. Three in a row. Third time lucky. Surely. Let's actually use a left foot for this one. Ben Gibson, come take this corner. Well, you're never taking corners again. I'd rather have you in the middle for them rather than taking them. Because that was poor. And now we've left ourselves wide open down this side. Good challenge. And you stood right in front of their player and you can actually miss the ball. Throw in here. And now you can get it on the chase. They're on the move now. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. There was no way that, that ball got to that player that cleanly after taking a deflection. There's no way he should have got that ball that easily after a deflection. Fine, we've got the ball. We're going to try and break from the back. No, we're not going to build from the back. We're actually going to break down and always concede. But oh wow, what a pass! If you didn't work that out, guys, that was sarcasm in my voice. Then I'm not actually happy with that pass whatsoever. That one, however, I am. Hindman, finish! Surely, you little American mongrel. <sighs> Apologies to any American fans I may have that are watching these videos. Uh, I do actually love you guys to bits. It's just I'm getting annoyed at myself and taking it out on my players. <sighs> really? Where is the movement? There is the movement. Hashtag real movement. Are you finish? That'll do. I don't. That's. I think that's Emerson Hindman. Uh, in fact, I can confirm that is Emerson Hindman. A young American who I was just bad mouthing about 45 seconds ago has just come in and actually scored a goal. See, that's why I love Americans. 
They get criticised and they go, you know what, forget this, I'm going to go and show you that what I can do. Why can't British people be like that? Britain would be a much better place if we had people like the Americans. Apart from the whole most obese country in the world thing, but I said about that the better. 88 minutes played here. No! Get away from my goal! Thank you. Good, cha good challenge, Gibson. Very good challenge, young man. Five minutes left of added time. Okay. Run! Run, Woodrow! You're quicker than this defender! Surely you absolute fish. It's fine. Let's keep the ball up their end. We'll win this game. It's at the wrong end of the pitch for them. There is the final whistle. We do win this match. 3-1 in the end. And we've got ourselves that first win of the season. Which is absolutely fan tabby dozy. So we're gonna quickly run through here and just check our emails just to see if we've got any emails regarding other players. We don't yet, but as you guys can see, the next match we will be playing is the Capital One Cup against Peterborough. That is gonna be left for the next episode though. So I'm just going to quickly have a look and see where that, that win put us in the table. We are currently third. It's not too bad. So we'll see if we can improve on that in two weeks' time. But for now, thank you so much for watching, guys. If you have liked this video, make sure you leave a like. If not, hit the dislike button in the comment section down below. Tell me why. Comment any players you guys want to see me sign because we are still in the transfer window. So if you know anyone that you've played on with on FIFA that you think may be a good fit for my team, then please, by all means, put them in the comment section down below. And of course, as always, subscribe to this channel if you're new around here. And I'll see you next Friday for a FIFA 15 career mode, and I'll see you on Sunday for a collab video. Thanks for watching, guys. Goodbye.